Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to your imaginary channel, the place where we dive deep into all things health and wellness. Today, we're tackling a topic that many of us are intimately familiar with, coffee. That's right, that aromatic elixir that kickstarts our mornings and keeps us going throughout the day. But have you ever wondered about the real scoop on coffee? Are there hidden benefits? Or perhaps some potential drawbacks? Well, you're in the right place, because in today's video, we're going to break it all down for you. But before we dive in, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell, so you never miss out on our latest videos. And hey, don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you find this video informative. Alright, let's jump right into the good stuff, the benefits of drinking coffee. 1. Mental alertness and focus. Coffee contains caffeine, a natural stimulant that helps improve alertness and concentration. It does this by blocking adenosine, a neurotransmitter responsible for making you feel tired. 2. Boosts physical performance. Caffeine can enhance physical performance by increasing adrenaline levels in your body. This can be especially beneficial for athletes and those engaging in high-intensity workouts. 3. Antioxidants galore. Coffee is packed with antioxidants, which help fight off harmful molecules in your body known as free radicals. These antioxidants can potentially reduce the risk of various diseases. 4. Mood Enhancer. Some studies suggest that moderate coffee consumption may be associated with a lower risk of depression and may even help improve mood. 5. Reduced risk of certain diseases. Research has shown that coffee drinkers may have a lower risk of certain diseases like Parkinson's, Alzheimer's, and even some types of cancers. The antioxidants in coffee are believed to play a role in this. Now, let's talk about the potential drawbacks of coffee consumption. 1. Sleep disruption. Consuming coffee, especially in large quantities or later in the day, can disrupt your sleep patterns. The stimulating effects of caffeine can make it harder to fall asleep and stay asleep. 2. Digestive issues. For some individuals, coffee can lead to gastrointestinal discomfort, including acid reflux, stomach upset, and even diarrhea. 3. Dependency and withdrawal. Regular consumption of coffee can lead to caffeine dependence. If you suddenly stop consuming it, you might experience withdrawal symptoms like headaches, fatigue, and irritability. 4. Increased heart rate and blood pressure. The stimulant effect of caffeine can lead to an increase in heart rate and blood pressure, which may not be suitable for individuals with certain pre-existing conditions. 5. Potential for addiction. While not everyone becomes addicted to caffeine, some individuals can develop a dependency that may lead to excessive consumption and potential negative health effects. So, what's the bottom line? As with many things in life, moderation is key. If you're a coffee lover, enjoy your cup of joe, but be mindful of your consumption. It's generally recommended to limit your caffeine intake to 400 mg per day, which is roughly equivalent to 4 cups of brewed coffee. Remember, individual tolerance to caffeine varies, so pay attention to how your body responds and adjust accordingly. And, of course, if you have any underlying health conditions, it's always a good idea to consult with a healthcare professional. Well, there you have it, folks, the benefits and potential drawbacks of drinking coffee. I hope you found this video informative and it helps you make informed decisions about your coffee consumption. If you enjoyed this content, make sure to give us a thumbs up and share it with your fellow coffee enthusiasts. And hey, don't forget to let us know your thoughts in the comments below. What's your take on coffee? Love it, hate it, or somewhere in between? Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you in the next one. Until then, stay happy, stay healthy, and keep sipping that coffee.